Till that the McDonald's advertising jingle I'm Lovin' It was first performed by Justin Timberlake and co-written by Pusha T. Pusha T regrets not securing publishing rights for his work that paid him half a million dollars, while Timberlake was paid six million to sing it. I think he learned his lesson and went on to make the Arby's jingle or something for a fuckton of money. As with all negotiations there has to be the possibility they'll pass on your work. So you have to balance the risk to the rewards, is 500k worth it or hold out for more such as publishing rights or royalties. Same story with the Nike logo and that Russian babushka. I bet he didn't regret getting the 500k at the time. I fondly regret not investing in Microsoft before I was born. WTF. Pusha T learned his lesson the second time around. The Arby's, we have the meats, is also him and he owns 40% of that. Yuka. Six million for JT. That's the first time I even knew it was him. Surely they could find a sound a like in LA who they could have paid like $500. The six million had to include other stuff like him attaching his name and face to McDonald's in some way. Right. I always thought that this was what happened when the jingle was written. JT's manager, Justin, you have that McDonald's jingle meeting today. JT, oh shit I do. I mean, yeah, I do. JT's manager, what have you got for them? JT, backslash unsure backslash B-A-W-A-B-A-B-A. I'm loving it. JT's manager, brilliant. It turns out, he's not loving it. As infectious a jingle as I'm loving it is, I really wish they'd find a new one already. It's been 17 years, McDonald's please. HTTPS colon slash slash www. YouTube. Com slash watch, V equals G-A-P-P-X-Z-A-B-K-R-I. HTTPS colon slash slash www. YouTube. Com slash watch, V equals G-A-P-P-X-Z-A-V-K-R-I. You mean push a T should have pushed for more. I literally recall seeing this announced on my local news when they said Justin was singing the new theme in the early 2000s. It was sort of strange to hear a huge star in that day using their voice for a fast food company. While I don't actually believe it was stolen, the jingle sounds an awful lot like daydreaming, https colon slash slash you do. B slash CL7 Joe -E -E 0 by the Christian band Furthermore. That song came out in 1999, four years before the I'm Loving It campaign. The lead singer seems to think it might have been stolen, based on his line in Pop Rock is Not Dead, https colon slash slash rotten musicians. Bandcamp com slash track slash pop rock is not dead at about 45 seconds he says daydream the song don's ripped off on his current band rotten musicians i was just thinking about this song the other day i remember it from high school poor pu shat would a major corporation allow someone else to own their jingo i still remember when it was we love to see you smile bada ba 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 i'm loving it Crimea River. Reminds me of Matthew Santos, sang the hook for Superstar as a favor to a producer friend because he's a super nice guy and Lupe was fairly unknown at the time. Song was a crazy hit but he never really got much in terms of royalties, and it's not like the Grammy nomination he received would ever pay. He still struggles to make ends meet as a musician, despite being an amazing songwriter and singer. Two million dollars a word? I'm kinda doubting that. It's worse than Brando in Superman. So instead he's getting royalties from Arby's. Good. Good thing he sells more bricks than records. Doesn't everyone know this? LOL. Capitalism. Timberlake is loving it. Badabababa -ba 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 King Push. I'm loving it is a great song. I'm gonna go listen to it now. It's not as good as your by Menon, but it's good. I too would regret that. What a dumbass. I've heard of JT, I've never heard of Pusha T. That's why he gets paid more. Half a mil is a good chunk of money for a jingle, even for the full song. Plenty of people make less than that for more work.